Now, once you have your dream, once you know what you're thinking about, I would encourage you to start to set some SMART goals. I don't know if you encounter that while you were learning, but SMART stands for specific, measurable, achievable, um, relevant, and time-bound. And there's some other, you know, some other versions of that. But basically, it takes the vision and makes it practical. It puts you into, in, into gear. You know, there's a story of, a, um, of an individual who was trying to save Jews in the Holocaust. And these individuals were living in, I think, Hungary or some other countries towards the end of the war. The Nazis at that point were desperate. They were looking for more funding. They wanted more trucks and more other things to support their war effort. And so they were willing to negotiate. And for every $100, a person was able to be saved. So this person was going around New York City and other areas trying to collect money in order to ensure that as many lives that could be saved as possible would in fact be saved. So he goes into this cleaner's shop and he says to the owner, listen, for every $100, now $100 70 years ago was a lot more money, but nonetheless, for every $100 that I save, it's another life. Think about the potential over here. Won't you make a contribution? So the man says, you know what? Look over there, you see the cash register? Go to the register, open it up, and take whatever you want. So the guy said, that's very beautiful. I really appreciate your generosity. But I gotta tell you, I got a question for you. The register is there, I'm here, you're there. We're both equidistant from the register. This is your store. Why are you sending me to your register? It doesn't make any sense. And the man said something that's very powerful that I think all of us can learn from. He said, because if I have to go to the register in the 20 steps that it will take for me to get from here to there, some of my enthusiasm might wane and I may make a lesser contribution. And so therefore, I want you to go because your enthusiasm will not wane, take as much as you need. And that I think is a very powerful lesson for all of us. As we walk out he from here today, we wanna have that vision. It might take a little time to develop, you don't have to do it by 10 o'clock. But you definitely do want to develop the vision and then you wanna act upon the vision. And whatever those next steps might be for you, of course they have to be specific, you have to be able to measure them, and they have to be achievable and you want to attach a time frame to it so that you can hold yourself accountable. And when I mentioned before that you should be developing strong ongoing networks with each other, that's a great use of that network where you can hold each other accountable. What goals have you set? And what goals have you set? And when can we get together to revisit to determine if we're on the right path or not? So that's the next thing that I would encourage you to do. Develop the vision, set the goals that you need in order to get there. Will Rogers once wrote, even if you are on the right track, you'll get run over if you just sit there. Think about that one for a second. So don't just sit there, do something.